Today we are at Natural Bridges State Beach. This park is 65 acres and located on the northernmost edge of Santa Cruz, California. And it's only about a 10 minute drive from Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk. Natural Bridges State Beach is named for its naturally occurring mudstone bridges. These were carved by the Pacific Ocean into cliffs. Of the three original arches, only the middle one remains. The outermost arch fell sometime between 1905 and 1906. The inner arch collapsed during a storm on the night of January 10, 1980. The middle arch that you see today is also in danger of collapsing. At one time, visitors were permitted to climb, walk, and even drive onto the bridges. But now, the arch is closed to all public access. But this beach is not the only thing that makes this place so special. This park also features a eucalyptus grove that provides habitat for migrating monarch butterflies. During the migration season from October through early February, the Monarch Butterfly Natural Preserve can have up to 150,000 monarch butterflies at any given time. Because the sun is quickly setting, we're going to first walk through the Monarch Butterfly Preserve to see all the butterflies, and then we will walk back out to the tide pools and beach as the sun sets. Please join us as we explore, and as always, if you like what you see, please like and subscribe. These eucalyptus tree flowers provide the butterflies with a much needed nourishing snack in the winter. They sip nectar once a week when it's available. This sanctuary shelters the butterflies from the chilly coastal winds. They capture warmth from the filtered sunlight. Butterflies are active when temperatures are above 60 degrees Fahrenheit. They can't even fly when temperatures are below 55 and can't even move when temperatures are below 45. Their wings act like solar panels. Once their bodies warm up, they take flight. Male and female monarchs recognize one another by color, shape, and veining. Males have black spots on the upper side of each wing and are lighter shade of orange. Females do not have these black spots on the upper side of their wings. The veins or black lines in the female wings are also much whiter than the males.
Thank you.